just going to put the Cuban rotation into a little bit of a complex. Uh, so this is just so good for working all the external rotators, strengthening the internal rotators a little bit and just working all the muscles in the upper back. So as Dai is going to show you, we're going to start with that high pull, elbows nice and high, come through the rotation, so arms just stay at 90 degrees the whole time, come back down onto the back of the neck, so into a behind the neck press, and just make sure we're keeping the elbows here rather than letting the elbows kind of roll forward. So we want to be pulling down into that position, making sure you're keeping the external rotation, pressing out overhead, and then pulling back down to 90, and then rotating back through and then reset the bottom. So that would be one rep. Obviously with this, we want to use like a really light weight just so we can actually control through. We don't want to be just like jamming into the joint or um, loading something that's kind of not ready to be, to be loaded. So um, starting with probably a 15 kilo bar max, um, but for most people probably starting a little bit lighter than that just to make sure you're actually getting the movement pattern pro um, nailed properly. How's that feeling, Nick? Toasty. Toasty. Nice.